the science of kriyas blood flow breathing air flow thought flow you have something called energy flow continuously happening in you in this energy circulation energy flow if there is a disturbance in some part for example liver kidney or heart intestine at some part if there is a disturbance in this energy circulation that is when you start developing diseases and disorders and disturbances disease disorders disturbances expresses itself in different ways the human body has seven circuits blood circuit circulatory system nerve circuit the nervous system prana circuit the respiratory system digestive circuit excretory circuit reproductive circuit and energy circuit of these circuits the energy circuit is governed by the kundalini energy though not spoken much by the medical science but elaborate references have been given for kundalini energy in the vedic tradition the kundalini energy is the innate immense potential energy in every individual that helps complete the energy circuit how does kundalini energy reach different parts of the body let us take the example of a water tank a water tank is a structure which stores water this water is distributed to different places through the pipelines which forms a circuit the pipelines end in outlet taps through which the water reaches the end users similarly the kundalini energy reaches the different parts of the body through the 72000 nadis or energy channels let's say for instance there is a block somewhere in the circuit of pipelines then what happens there is no flow of water then you identify and correct the block even if the blockage is removed water has to be pumped in for the flow to resume similarly when there is a block in the energy circuit in the body there is impedance to energy flow forward and it results in disease in that particular organ the kundalini energy in our body is like the water in the water tank kriyas are powerful tools which help to remove the energy blockage and restore the energy flow when the body is aligned in certain postures during kriyas the energy block is removed once the block is removed the kumbhaka pumps in the kundalini energy just as the water gets pumped in to the pipeline once the block is removed when the energy flow is reestablished energy starts flowing and the disease is healed now if your body is put in certain position the energy blockages get removed the energy circulation that plumbing gets properly aligned the wiring gets properly aligned after that the kumbhaka starts pumping the energy into that circuit see putting your body in certain asana makes the circuit blockage free the circuit becomes perfect but only through the kumbhaka the energy gets pumped in into the circuit this is exactly the principle on which kriya works kriyas are a unique combination of asanas pranayamas and kumbhakas wherein they are more effective than the individual asanas and pranayamas even for few seconds if the energy circuit route is aligned and energy is pumped you are out of the disease you are out of the disorder you are free these kriyas are not just ordinary asana ordinary yoga postures ordinary kumbhaka 
ordinary pranayama it is like a two different chemicals separately if you take it may take 10 years for you to cure the disease but mix properly in certain combination it removes the disease in two days in one dosage the kriyas help to restore the energy imbalance and which results in healing diseases kriyas help to heal the body experience extraordinary powers and to have spiritual experience in the body these kriyas are my unique contributions to the world the kriyas have seven ingredients one yoga second kumbhaka pranayamas third visualizations fourth verbalization means chanting of some mantra internally see internally when you create the sound it's called mantra externally when you listen it's called chanting so mantra internal verbalization fifth chanting external the sound you are hearing and sixth now i am adding karanas the different shiva tandava karanas seventh i am adding the lat recent discoveries of modern day gymming and weight lifting so all these seven put together i work on your body and mind creating yogic body and vedic mind power stamina flexibility basic energy all the five put together is yogic body i am using all the seven ingredients to create yogic body for you